I'm Alicia, aka Rhapsody. Welcome to my channel. Today I wanted to share with you my initial impressions and swatches of a new eyeshadow palette that I picked up recently. And that is the BH Cosmetics Foil Eyes Palette. Uh, this palette this palette is a dupe for the Makeup Geek uh, foil shadow. It is an incredibly good deal in terms of price. Um, those foil shadows from Makeup Geek, I believe, are $10 a piece, and this whole palette, which contains 28 shadows, is 12 bucks, or at least it was when I picked it up. Um, BH Cosmetics is a bargain brand that is constantly running sales, so palettes from any at any given time can range from 8 to 15 bucks, but it's going to be cheap whenever you And I also did recently pick up the Metal Matte Palette. I will be reviewing that um, at some point. I'll get around to it um, from Kat Von D. And these shadows, while not as creamy, are um, fairly comparable to the metal shadows from that limited edition Kat Von D. Palette as well. Um, in fact, they, for me, blended a little bit better. Um, so I want to show you, I want to swatch these out for you and show you the colors. I played with this and uh, this is what I'm wearing on my eyes today. I found that although they're, um, as I said, not as creamy as some of the more premium brands, they did blend very well and the pigmentation is excellent. You get um, a large pan of each shade. I am not sure if these are vegan, but this uh, does not keep, contain any carmine in it. And I am really impressed with all of the colors, so I'm gonna swatch these out so you can see them. And I will do it in little rows of four. So the first row here, the first row here is a silver, an off-white silver, a kind of ro um, ro light rose, dusty rose, and pink. And this is what they look like swatched out. See, they are very metallic. shade today on the inner portion of my eye and this shade on my lower lash line. Alright, the second row is kind of a silvery gray, a gunmetal. This is kind of a, a brown and um, I guess what I would call a plum. And I am wearing the silvery gray on my eyes. the center of my eyelid today. Alright, next we have purples and blues. We have a light purple, a darker purple, kind of a jeweled blue, and a pink purple. These are really nice. So, this is like a metallic lavender, uh, kind of standard purple, this jeweled blue is similar to the blue in Kat Von D's Serpentina palette and pink purple there. There really are an exciting number of colors in this palette. Alright, next we have uh, greens and more blues. This one's a 
the green was some uh, a light kind of sea foam green. It's kind of an aqua blue green. This is kind of a, an olive gray and a, a nice um, nice bright uh, almost baby blue a little bit deeper than baby blue. have just a touch of this shade um, on my eyes today as well. Moving on we have greens and yellows. Sorry for the glare there. Alright, I'm not quite sure how to describe this shade. It's kind of a taupe with a greenish undertone. And this is uh, kind of light olive, okay, a soft canary yellow, and a yellow gold. second to last row we're getting into very warm colors and this palette really shines in these um, red earthy sh earthy um, shades all right so in this row we have a peach a copper uh, what I can only describe as a pumpkin and a very metallic dark orange final row which contains like our reds and browns. Now I'll admit these first two shades uh, look pretty much the same to me swatched. This um, third shade though is a blue brown shade that that I just really love um, and the final shade is a dark uh, metallic brownish red that is fantastic. And I do actually have um, these last three shades all on my eyes today. Blended all along um, the outer edge and the lower outer lash line. So, that's what these look like. You can see those first two shades really do look very similar. That blue brown, mm, and then that final deep shade. So as you can tell, and I, I of course am in no way affiliated with BH Cosmetics, but I, this palette just seems like a no-brainer to me. If I'd realized how, how much I was going to like it, I would have purchased it a lot sooner. Twelve bucks for this, just why not? You get 28 metallic shadows. They all um, are very pigmented and seem to function quite nicely um, and I'm overall very happy with the purchase. I did purchase some other things from BH Cosmetics as well which I will be sharing with you in, in, up, in upcoming videos so stay tuned for that. I thank you so much for watching and until next time have a fabulous day. Bye bye.